Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining what keyframing is and how you can possibly do it in Flip a Clip. So let's get right into it. Flip a Clip is a free uh, editing or rather animation creating software for mobile phones and for uh, Windows 11 devices. And it is, as I've said, used for making animations by drawing your own uh, frames. As you can see here, I have a uh, animation pulled up of a simple head bobbing animation which I have created and I will uh, attempt to explain what keyframing is for this. Now, as you can see this animation is really rough and to make it smoother you can use the process known as keyframing. Now, uh, in Flip a Clip there is no option to keyframe. There are no keyframes uh, and there is no such functionality in the app. So whatever you might want to do with keyframing, you will need to do manually. Keyframing is basically selecting the beginning and the end frames, which are the keyframes from which a smooth transition begins. In Flip a Clip, the maximum thing you can do, at least in the free version, is to create a 30 frames per second project and then animate every frame yourself and every transition, such as moving your characters and everything by yourself. Now, as you can see, this is a five frames per second animation. And if I brought it up to 30 frames, it would be a much smoother head bobbing, um, what do you call it, animation. However, I would need to manually create all those frames by tilting the head myself and everything. Now, the way I tilted the head of my character is just selecting it and then just rotating it like this and whoops, and moving it uh, here like this. And that is how I created this animation, but I would make need to make it a lot smoother such as tilting it just a few degrees per frame, like so. And uh, yeah, that is pretty much what you will need to do to manually create your keyframes. There is sadly no functionality in Flip Clip as of now, and probably there won't be. So I'm sad to say that I can't help you guys in that regard. However, I hope I made it clear enough for you to know what keyframing is and how you could possibly emulate it in Flip Clip. And that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be seeing you guys next time.